All right, guys, so today I'm here with John from Maryville, Tennessee, and he is going to show us this awesome Intech Flyer boondocking machine. This thing is incredible. John, if you want to say hello to everybody. <laughs> hey, out there. All right, guys, we will show you this tour. This is an amazing little rig we got behind us here. Okay guys, so today we're gonna to give you a walkthrough of this Intech Flyer Pursuit. We'll start out here. So as you see, this has a built-in awning. It actually wraps all the way around to the front of the rig, which is really, really cool. This thing is 14 feet long. It does not have any kind of bath or shower in it. So, you know, this is truly made for boondocking, getting outside, getting out into nature. This thing is incredible. So we'll start over here. I'm gonna have John open up this bay for us and he will show us the kitchen area. Here we have the slide out kitchen. Has a uh, two burner grill here. Runs off the propane tank there. So we got the propane tanks up front on the tongue. And a storage box here. Cups, dishes, plates, everything. And then this Dometic cooler which uh, has a cold side for really cold items and then a cool side for your bread and your other items you might want and guys this is absolutely amazing so this is a complete outdoor kitchen that is ready to go and john if i remember right you said this nomadic freezer refrigerator can be removed you could haul it in your car mm -hmm. and have additional stuff in you here can. you can it just comes right out really neat there so and then up here also guys you got two extra outlets that you can use to power different stuff that you need to outside and over here you've actually got an extra little table or prepare area whatever you need to do over here you've got a, additional stuff that you can do on it like a dining table whatever you want it to be so that's really neat and this comes off and it mounts here okay that so, is neat so it makes one complete top that is cool yeah. and, and the other and cool thing about, and the other cool thing about this is the once he pulls this down to his garage or wherever he wants it to be if he needs to adjust it he can actually move all this by hand so that's another cool feature of this thing yeah it's not very heavy it weighs in at 1600 pounds wow that is incredible just close that up so now you'll see him close that up and so here's the tires on it this does have the upgraded off-road suspension so he can pretty much take this about anywhere he wants to go you can see the green cap for the nitrogen filled tires and then when you look at these tires these are just amazing off-road tires that's one of the first things i noticed when i passed by here so absolutely incredible and now he is going to show us the inside and for 14 feet this thing has a ton of room in it so here's their sleeping area. You see their AC going here, which keeps it really, really cool in here. Nice little shades to cover the windows. They got the Max Air fan. He's got a TV that he's added on. And what you see on the wall to the back over here is his solar controller. So this thing does have a 100 amp solar panel on it, which works out perfect for him so far as what he said. He's had this for about a week. And then you see his powering area. So he's got the USB charger, a 12 volt cigarette lighter charger. So pretty much everything you need. Additional storage up top. And then over here, he has his stereo and speakers. There you go, guys. Absolutely incredible setup. This is a true boondocking piece of equipment. I have been very impressed looking at this. They also come with a fire alarm, and they come with a, uh, which has a um, uh, carbon monoxide detector in it, and a propane detector as well. So there you go, it's guys. A leak. So, yep, very and safe. All the safety features that you need. So now we will move around to the back. And this has two sliding or two opening doors on the back so you can access everything from the inside from back here as well you also got additional storage up here in the cargo nets and as you can see back here you got lights for on and off you got extra outlet plugs here so absolutely incredible setup guys i love this thing it has been amazing to to see it and get to look through it Then we come back over here to this side. So it does have stabilizers on it. Those are manual stabilizers. You let them down just to kind of help stabilize out the, the little rig. It comes with a spire tire for it as well. Should be fairly easy to put. And again, you can see it's not a cheap spire. It's an actual tire that comes on an extra. 
It's got the cable hookups. It's got your power hookups here. And this is a 30 amp power hookup. And then here, here was another cool feature I loved about this thing. So this here, the little tube that you see is the TV antenna. That is just really neat for me. Here you see his 100 watt solar panel. You see the max air fan. And then you see this massive AC unit for this little rig, which he said keeps it like a meat freezer inside. <laughs> and then the also you got go this, uh, oh, go if you want to move to that. Um, okay, yeah, so the windows here, he just said they go up and down, so that's cool for ventilation. And then the other really cool thing is this storage rack up here, so he could actually store stuff on the top if he needed to. So just absolutely incredible rig. And this is the 2018 model. Mm -hmm. He got it used. And John, if I remember right, you said you were looking for a actual, like a teardrop, but then you ended up coming into this. Mm -hmm. Absolutely incredible. And guys, the other cool thing is the little step ups here that you can actually get up on top if you needed to seal up the roof or anything like that. Both sides. Yeah, and that's on both sides. So you can get up there and do what you need to do really without any kind of a ladder, which is a huge plus. This has a 250 pound weight limit on it, they say. Okay. For the, from the factory. So, kayaks or bicycles is no problem. See, that's incredible too. So, you get a lot out of a little a little space here. And this bank here, and I won't, uh, if you want to open it up, you can. But this is where the battery bank lives. So, it does have one battery. Uh, currently, it's just a deep cycle lead acid battery. Maybe, maybe not. He'll upgrade to a lithium. But, very cool setup in here so yeah, this is just very impressive this also comes pre-wired for uh, uh this is loose right here but you have a fixture here in the front it's pre-wired for uh, an additional oh okay solar okay. panel yeah so so basically up here then you've got the uh, plug-in for either basically on the ground solar panel or a suitcase if you wanted to have something to just to move around to get better sunlight that is neat too so I love when they come and for this thing that's all you would ever need that's incredible so they they have really thought about everything for this to get you out and boondocking so guys I'll give you one more good walk around this thing definitely check it out this is absolutely amazing I'll be able to see you on YouTube. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. All right, guys. So there's a full walk around view of it. Incredible rig. I seen this at the park and had to come up and meet the guy, talk with him. And very thankful, John, that you let me look at this, but I love this thing. I wanted to say thank you to John and his son for allowing me to tour the rig. It was absolutely amazing. I also wanted to thank everybody for watching and invite you to subscribe, like, share, and comment. Thank you all.